Hey everybody, today I'm going to do a video where I'm going to be um, doing a system restore on my Toshiba A305D-S6848 um, Windows Vista laptop. Um, it's a 32-bit uh, Windows Vista Home Premium. And so, uh, what I've got here is the laptop itself. Fully charged the battery last night. Um, I have the AC adapter on the side. I have fully taken out all the memory, put them on the memory sticks and um, put them on a new computer and I'm just gonna restore this guy so first what you wanna do um, put in your recovery disk in your drive DVD drive there's two disks total then shut down your computer and just wait for it to shut down um, and here's what the disk and stuff is in um, I followed the instructions on the back, didn't work for me, um, so uh, I'm making this video to show another way just in case you're wondering. Uh, there's other videos showing um, how to do this system restore and everything. Alright, so now the laptop is off, it shut down, um, the disk is in the drive. Power it back on. Now I believe it's F12. Uh, wait till the Toshiba screen comes up, press F12 to boot manager. Then move all the way down to um, CD, DVD, press enter, or click, whatever you think it's better for you. Um, okay, so wait for it to run. It's going to run the CD, DVD drive, <clears throat> and then it'll bring you to the uh, options center, either to reboot the whole system to when it's out of the box state, or just to some certain point. Uh, but then I think you can do that in the start menu too. Um, yeah. So give it a couple minutes. It's loading the files. Uh, re I've done this about say three times to this computer. Um, this computer doesn't really have much problems. It's just that it's good to I guess uh, you know make it feel like brand new or something. <laughs> Or I guess if you got something corrupting the computer or something you want to remove, then it's it's a good way to do it. Um, mine does have, I believe, a clogged heat sink, which will cause the CPU, I mean not the CPU, the computer, or yeah, pretty much um, to shut down just at an instant when it's a bit warm. Uh, the heat sink does need to be clean. Uh, of course, I'm not really sure how to do it, so um, probably gonna leave it to someone else. All right, let's see. Yeah, like I said, it's gonna take a couple minutes, so I'll pause it until the screen is until it's done. All right, so here it's the loading. Uh, it says Microsoft Corporation on the bottom. It'll it's load. It'll load into the setup uh, menu. All right, so here's the um, process menu or whatever. First one is Toshiba Recovery Wizard or System Recovery Options. Uh, I just go to uh, Toshiba Recovery Wizard. Next. Wait for another while. Okay, so warning: when the recovery is executed, all data will be deleted and rewritten. If you're restoring from backup, did you make sure all your backup is important data? Blah blah. blah. And please connect the AC adapter. Make sure your battery does not die. Uh, I'll do that later. And you're pretty much just backup all your stuff. So you have two options: to either erase all the hard disk or recover of out of factory state box which is pretty much when you first turn it on, which I'm going to do. Uh, yep, recovery out of state box, or choose whatever you want to do, but most likely recovery out of state box, all portions will be deleted, yep, okay. So yeah, that'll take another couple minutes, I guess. And yep, still preparing um, the partition, so you got to wait a couple minutes. Happens every time. Pretty much same thing to every computer. And so here we are still at the recovery or the preparing menu. It'll take about say five minutes. It's been five minutes already so I don't know. It takes time. Alright so that's been a nice long five to ten minutes wait. Um, now it's preparing it's copying files and you can hear the disk start to run in the uh, DVD drive. And I guess you gotta wait for some uh, time too and um, 
you know, they'll have an estimated time of how long it's going to take and how many files and they'll have a loading bar and things. Show that. I'm going to pause the video real quick. Alright, so um, it's taken a really long while. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to make a second video to where the part um, they have the uh, all the updates and stuff and they'll require a second disc. So I'll have that as a video response. And yeah, uh, thanks for watching this first video and hope you'll follow on.